A Chattanooga police officer mistook a man for a suspect, hitting him with a stun gun and pointing a firearm at him. That is according to a lawsuit recently fired in Hamilton County Court. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kim Chapman. And I'm Josh Rowe. Bliss segment spoke to the man's lawyer tonight. Bliss, what did he, what did he tell you? Josh Kim, attorney Robin Flores says this is another case that shows CPD officers using excessive force. He says Officer Cody Thomas assaulted and falsely arrested Nate Carter, but police reports tell a different story. Get it over here, right? This body cam video shows a CPD officer hitting a man with a stun gun as he walks away. Officer Cody Thomas was called to Vance Avenue on April 13th of 2018 after a neighbor called 911 saying a man named Polo was waving a gun around. Are you Polo? That was your name. According to the police affidavit, Officer Thomas thought Nate Carter met the suspect description. While he's on top of him, takes his thumb and jams it into the man's area right here around the jawline. Um, which I suspect they're going to say is a pain compliance, but that's also with the carotid artery and the jugular vein are at. Attorney Robin Flores says the officer's actions were unlawful. The lawsuit alleges that Officer Thomas conducted an unreasonable seizure, used excessive force, authorized a false report, and more. So what are you charging him with? So I can tell the his wife when she get here, she's going to be asked about uh, Disorderly and resisting. A CPD spokesperson says Internal Affairs conducted an investigation resulting in Officer Thomas's suspension for 80 hours in November of 2018. This isn't the first time this officer's actions have been questioned. Flores filed another suit against Thomas that states he used excessive force and conducted an unreasonable seizure on another man two months before this incident. Come here. You can't look for what? Oh, shoot. You know, police are supposed to be made of a higher and better metal. All of the charges against Carter were dismissed. Kim. Liz, thank you. Several members of the community have called for a citizen oversight committee. Members appointed by city council would review questionable law enforcement actions. Chattanooga City Council has been discussing the development of the oversight committee for several weeks. At this point, there has not been an official vote.